Good morning guys and welcome to part two of the job academic job interview video series. Um, as you can see I'm on the train on my way up north. Um, I am feeling not too bad about my paper. Um, I'm not quite sure how it will go but I will check back in with you when it is over and let you know how the whole thing went. Okay, bye! I've made it and I recognise where I am from having been to conferences and things here. So that is a very good sign. I'm just having a quick coffee before I go and get myself organised um, and go and check in. So. I will be back with you. I've organised to have lunch with a friend after the presentation, so I will come back a little bit after that and let you know how I've got on. Okay, bye! I'm feeling alright, by the way. I'm not feeling too bad. I think I've got this covered. I hope. Bye! Hi guys. i just done my paper and I feel like it didn't go very well. I went off script, which was always my plan, as I had said. Um, I started on script uh, with the script in front of me and that I, was just distracting me. I kept looking down at it, so I kind of put it to the side and just went off my plan. I think that was the right thing to do either way. Um, there was a man making faces and that put me off. Um, because I obviously you just want people to think that you know what you're doing is really good and it kind of I don't, I don't know so I can't I really have to ace the interview tomorrow I think to be in with a shot um, at one of these positions and I really oh. so yeah I don't know and then I rambled on one of the questions just like I'm rambling right now so that was not the best thing that I could have done. But we'll see, we'll see what happens. Okay, bye. Hi guys. As you can see, I'm in a picturesque alley and it's a little bit windy. I'm post interview. So, how did it go? Um, I don't know. I feel confident. I was confident, I was enthusiastic. I asked the questions I wanted to ask. I gave the examples I wanted to give. Um, so I'm happy with how it went. I really couldn't have done anything else, I think. So it will really, I, I, I can't tell one way or the other. Um, the questions that I was asked, asked were mainly teaching focused. First I was asked why I applied for the position. That is a fairly standard question that you should probably always have an answer to. Always you should have an answer to. Then I was asked some very teaching focused questions, including course specifics, um, some things about like my overall teaching philosophy, how I would deal with different types of levels of courses, um, big courses, little courses, lower level courses, upper level courses, etc. Um, then I had an opportunity to kind of talk about more my teaching and give some examples of some things. I gave my amazing um, putting Alexander on trial for the death of Clysus example. I'm about to be over run over by a truck. Oh, now I'm out in the sunshine. Um, so, it was not too bad, I think. What other questions was I asked? Um, yeah, and, they, and then some course specific questions. What kind of course would I want to teach? If I could teach two of anything I wanted, what would I teach? And then if I, because I would have to teach, you know, from a set of specific courses, which one I would want and how I would teach it. So luckily I had kind of, I had thought about all of those things before and I had answers, I think is the main thing. I had detailed and I hope intelligible, I hope interesting answers to those questions. Um, and then obviously I got an opportunity to ask questions myself to them. Um, so the main thing that I asked was about what their undergraduates tend to go on to do after classics and what kind of transferable skills they need for those and 
Um, and the, the answer was so wide ranging um, from, you know, into finance and things that you might expect from graduate programs that often take classics graduates to like football manager. So that was good. And then um, I got to ask about what research provision there is for teaching fellows. Uh, obviously that would be unofficial for a teaching only position. Um, and that was, I mean, you know, and then I asked about the new master's course that they're putting together um, that the people, the person who gets this job will have to contribute to. So that's what they asked, that's what I asked, and now I'm going to go and get on a train and forget that, try and push this out of my mind. I have um, with me more than belief, so I'm going to read this on the train on the way home and then I am going to collapse in a heap. Um, I have some admin things to do for the Classics and Feminist Ped Pedagogy Day, um, which we're having at the end of July, which is going to be amazing. Um, I'm going to put a link below to the information and sign up for that. Um, and so I will see you again. I'll be back. Okay, bye.